Okay, here's how it works. We take a good-looking guy, then we introduce him to three beautiful women, and then at that point, who hooks up, who doesn't? Well, it's up to the gods to decide. But I'll tell you one thing, at the end, one lucky couple is gonna get to go on the big date. Yeah! Thank you very much. Thank you very much, I'm Mark Wahlberg. This is The Big Date, and a quick hello to the 3rd Battalion, 4th Marines who are joining us today. You know why they're here? They're here for the same reason you're here. You want to see the, today's players who are going to try to hook up with members of the opposite sex. We're going to help them do this. If they do hook up with that perfect love, they're going to have a chance to go on a really big date. We will pay for that date. The Marines chipped in. It's going to be a good date. A cheap date, he says. No, it's going to be a big date. The temptation, though, lurks behind every single door. There's always a chance that somebody could get dumped, just like real life. You know how it works. Let's meet somebody right now, a real live person. Quante Love, 29-year-old personal trainer. Quante, what's happening? How you living? Good. 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 Quante Love. How yeah. could you go wrong with a name like Quante Love? Yeah, can't. You just can't. So Quante. Yeah, right. What's the woman that's gonna just set you off? What do you want? She has to have a body. She better have a body and a brain. She's a brain too. Yeah, body and a brain. I see. The Personality. Whole she has to be funny. This girl just got to be head to toe. She's got to be everything. Yeah, that's be everything. Well, that's a that's a tough order. Well, then try to be everything. You don't have to just try. All right. Well, you, you come back from your agreement now. All right. Let's see what we can do for you. We got some great ladies okay. who want to meet you, and I want to introduce you to Nisha Wilson. She's 24 years old. She's a beauty consultant. Nisha. <laughs> Have a seat right over there. How you doing? She just gave you the eye when she came in. Did you okay. feel that? I feel it. I'm yeah. sure you did. Say hello to our next lovely lady, Yolanda Jones. She's a 25-year-old customer service representative. Hi, Hi Yolanda. How you, doing? you can stand right, sit right over there. Yolanda came and said, I'm playing. Don't bring anybody else out. I'm staying right here. But we'll earn that spot. Rhonda Hicks is 23 years old. She's a waitress. Say hello to Rhonda. 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 You want body, you want brains, you want personality. Let's find out a little bit about the personality. First Shall of all, we? Nisha, Nisha, how do you make a guy feel special when you're out on a date with him? When I'm out on a date with him? Yeah, or just in general. In general, I would totally pamper you. I would definitely have to massage those beautiful arms, those oh, muscles. Touch me, girl. <laughs> <laughs> I would just really, basically, try to get to know the person and just keep everything very relaxed and just enjoy you. Oh. <laughs> It's all about me. All about it's you, all about me. I'm just a passenger in your world, Quante. Move out of the way, okay? That's all right. I'm just <laughs> backseat. Yolanda, how about you? What, what are you going to do to make Quante go, oh, Yolanda? I would spoil you so senseless until you'd be totally useless to humankind. Quante, oh. <laughs> she'll erase you from the planet. You'll Erase cease to me. exist. I'll bring the eraser, girl. That's right. <laughs> Rhonda, how about you? Hard to, hard to follow that, but what would you do? It is very hard to follow that. But I love to exercise, so I take you for a nice long run on the beach. And when you passed out, I give you a little mouth to mouth to revive you. Oh, <laughs> oh my gracious, Quante. What do we do now? We should make a choice, shouldn't we? I don't want all three of them. You can't do it. I'll take them. Everybody come to my house. Oh. <laughs> Quante, I think okay. that would be dangerous for your health to have all three ladies come to your house. Is it going to be Nisha? She'll pamper you. Is it Yolanda? She's going to knock you senseless. Or Rhonda, who's going to make you pass out and then take advantage of you? I think it's going to be Nisha. Nisha it is. Bring it up, up here, girl. All the way up here, Nisha. Come on up here, girl. What about Nisha, Quante? What about Nisha? Yeah, why, why did you choose Nisha? Did you see how she walked through the door? I didn't. She Nisha walked out and she was like... Yeah. I'll take you home. I was like, I'm going. <laughs> right it was the you. eyes, I think, Nisha. Yeah, I Here's think what happened. I'd love to see the two of you hook up and be happy together. I've got some questions here, kind of a test to see if you're really compatible. If you both match answers twice, you're a lucky couple. You could win the big date. Ready? Your friends want to know the details of a hot date. They want to know, y'all, do you A, kiss and tell, or B, keep your lips sealed? Yes, yes. Oh. <laughs> Nisha, you need to know that about Quante. He'd tell. When it comes to getting physical on a first date, do you A, wait for them to make the move, or B, reach out and touch someone? <laughs> oh. Man, you know, 
along with the audience. I thought this was a clicking thing, but it, it's not happening, Quante. Have a seat. Nisha, Quante, we'll try again. Oh, Yolanda, come on up here. Oh, my goodness. Yolanda, Nisha and Quante, they had eye contact, things were going, but it just didn't click. Right. It's now your turn. Now, you may think that Quante made the wrong choice, and you need to set him straight. So you'd pick him and bring him up here. But before you do that, I'm gonna introduce you to a couple guys. Please do. I will. Thank you. Oh, wow. Nothing personal. Oh, no. Nothing personal. Person. No. No, no, no. Don't get your feelings hurt yet. <laughs> Dirk Colas is 34 years old. He's a lady shoe salesman. He knows how to deal with shoes. Dirk, come on out. There he is. Dirk! One other guy I'd like to bring out. Say hello to Kent Bennett. He's 25 years old. He's an energy consultant. <laughs> Kent Bennett. <laughs> oh, drink of water. That's right. Like How to see you, Ken? What's up, baby? All right, Dirk, All right. we want to hear a little something from you. Beautiful Yolanda here doesn't know anything about you. How do you make Yolanda feel special? Well, first of all, I'll take her to a nice dinner, you know, buy flowers and a lot of poems. And after that, probably massage your foot. Massage your foot. Oh. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Dirk, where's your accent from? Where are you from? Heaven. Heaven. <laughs> I should have recognized. I'm sorry, Dirk. Yes, Kent, how does Yolanda make a decision at this point? Why should she pick you? Tell us. Because I would do something no other guy I've ever done to you before. Yeah. Oh. First, first, I would take you to a nice dinner. Mm -hmm. Then I would take you home, read you nice poetry, then make love to you, then wake up. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not done yet. And then, that's not it. We're not and then, done. when you wake up, breakfast will be ready. Breakfast yeah. will be ready when you wake up. Oh. Wow. <laughs> so what's it gonna be? Are you, are you gonna go to heaven with Dirk? He's been there, that's where the accent comes from. <laughs> Kent's gonna take you out to dinner, he's gonna love you up, then he's gonna feed you breakfast. Yeah. Quante made a mistake, he may admit it. He may want another shot here at Yolanda. Don't write Quante off yet. Who's oh, it gonna no. be? Got to make a choice. It's tough. Got to have a rough neck, Kent. Kent. Yeah. Kent, come on up. <laughs> Kent, stand right over here. Why'd you choose Kent? Got to have a rough neck. Oh. <laughs> well. Okay, guys, are you ready? Yeah. Match two, and you get to just have a couple meals together. What do you do if your mate isn't in the mood? Hmm, do you? A, throw in the towel, call it a night. Or B, blow on their coals and hope for some sparks. Yeah. Oh, no. no hesitation. You may not want to stay here, Kent. You may not want to stay with Yolanda. I mean, Nisha's over there. She wants to pamper somebody, that's all. She just wants to put a little powder on you and diaper you up. Rhonda's over here, wants to run you on the beach till you drop and then breathe in your mouth till you wake up. What are you gonna do, Kent? You're gonna stay with Yolanda? Is it gonna be Nisha or Rhonda? You can Gonna stay here. What is it about your line that you like? She's very outgoing and she knows what she wants. She knows what she Straight wants. Straight to the point. Straight to the point. And hopefully you're the point. Right. Right on. All right, get this one right. You are our first lucky couple. What would be more crushing? What would be more crushing, you guys? A, being fired from a job, or B, getting dumped by a mate? What hurts most? Oh! You can handle the rejection of a mate, but the job hurts. Well, you didn't get any rejection. You guys are our first couple. Congratulations. That's one. A lot of heat going on there. We've got more work to do, though. We'll take a break. When we come back, we'll try to hook up another happy couple right here on the big day. Welcome back to the big date. Hey, Kent and Yolanda, man, that was nothing but sparks and heat. How are things going back there, y'all? It's cool. Things are good. Give them a round of applause. Yeah. Cool. Cool. There's one man whose accent comes from heaven. Let's see if we can find him a heavenly match. Dirk, you're up. Give him a round of applause, folks. Right over here. Dirk. Dirk, two beautiful women here. Nisha is over there, wants to pamper you. Rhonda wants to run you on the beach, then love y'all up. Dirk. You could choose either of these beautiful women. You've been, you know them a little bit. You got to hear from them. There is another woman backstage, behind the door. Dirk, she could be the perfect woman for you. What do you want to do? I want to go with 
Rhonda. Rhonda? Yeah. He likes Rhonda, folks. Come on up, Rhonda. What is it about Rhonda you like? She looks wild. She looks wild. wild. She wanted the door. You look wild to him. I am. Wild. Would you like to see who you passed up, the girl who's behind the door? Should we show you? Yeah. You guys want to see? Let's bring her up. This is Stacy Scott, 20 year old administrative assistant. Hi, Stacy. Oh. It's all right, Rhonda is here. She looks wild. Yes? Yes, indeed. Yes, she does. All right, get two right and you guys will get wild together. Here's your first statement. Get this one right, guys. After a heated argument, are you A, the first to forgive, or B, the last to give in? B. Oh. You got none right. Let's try again, see if you can get this one right. Ready? What are you most proud of? A, your moral fiber, or B, your stamina in bed? Got to answer. Right on, baby. All right, well, you got one right. One more right. You are second lucky couple. Rhonda, he chose you. You may want to stay with Dirk. He's a little slice of heaven. But Quante Love, he's a personal trainer. His, his muscles are bulging. Look at that. And behind the door is one special something. So what are you going to do, Rhonda? It's going to be Quante. You're going to stay with Dirk or you going to go behind the door? I'm going to take the door. You're going to take the door? She's taking the door. Say hello to the man behind the door. Marvin Thomas, 26-year-old barber. Sorry, Dork, have a seat. Marvin, nice to see you, my friend. Grab those paddles. That's all right? That's all right. That's all right. If your fiancé wanted you to sign a prenuptial agreement, mm -mm, would you A, sign on the dotted line, or B, tell him to get lost? Ah. You don't believe in the prenup, huh? No? Nope, sure don't. You think if you're going to get married? If you're going to get married, let's just do this. There you go. <laughs> yeah. You agree with that, Rhonda? Yes. All right. Well, you're not getting married right now, but you're close to becoming a couple. If you guys match again, you're there. Marvin, <laughs> you didn't get a chance to see Rhonda before you came out. Hopefully, you're pleased. It's working. But have you met Nisha? Look how pretty she is. Mm. Stacy, we haven't even heard from Stacy. She was a mystery woman herself. Came out here. Who you want to be with, Marvin? <laughs> I'm gonna go with number two. I'm gonna go with Stacy. Stacy, oh, I'm sorry, Rhonda. We'll try again here. Take that one. Stacy, come on. Hi, Stacy. Well, isn't this an interesting thing, mystery man, mystery woman? It could be great. Why did you choose her? Well, she, she's gorgeous. She's uh, quite spectacular. Quite spectacular. Quite spectacular. Stacey. That's very nice. Guys, match mm -hmm. a couple times and you'll be spectacular together. <laughs> Your date goes on a business trip with a sexy co-worker. Mm -mm. Do you A, trust them to be good, or B, call and check up on them? Oh. You, you, you would trust him. If he's on a business trip, you're okay with that? Yeah, well, you got me. Why would you need anybody There else? you go. Let's uh, try yeah. one more time, see if you get one right. Okay. While on vacation, you come across a nude beach. Wow. Do you A, stay undercover, or B, just let it all hang out. Yeah. Oh. Oh, Marvin, you don't want the new beach thing? Hey, I, you know, I would be undercover, you know what I'm saying? Because it might be a, a beach full of nasty, naked people. Yeah, <laughs> that's a good point. Guys, you didn't have to have seats. Sorry, Marvin, didn't work out. Have a seat. I'll take you back up. Let it go. Bring up the Quante, yeah. what are you going to do? Nisha, bring it on, girl. Come on, girl. You know, girl, baby. Oh. Come on, back to Nisha. Come on, Nisha. You got to love that, Nisha. <laughs> it didn't work out, and he was looking right in the face of danger, picked you again. That's fine with me. All right, here we go, guys. Okay. Being intimate with someone means, A, bearing your soul, or B, bearing your butt. <laughs> Yeah, I'm telling you. <laughs> it's a much prettier thought to see your souls being bared instead of, instead of your butt. You got oh, one right. That. One more right. You are a couple. <sighs> Nisha, your choice. You want to stay? You finally... I mean, it's four questions, but you're now cooking. Yes. Could be Quante. Yes. What about Dirk? Marvin just came on the scene. <laughs> What's going to be, Nisha? Marvin. 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 He needed someone else to make his decision. So oh. That's so I'll stick with Quante. Yeah. All right. All right, all right, all right. Here you go, baby. Yeah. I feel like the audience wants you guys to hook up, all right? So get this one right. If your best friends, excuse me, if your best friend wins the lottery, are you A, excited they won, or B, jealous as hell? Come on, 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 Come on,
we like to see. We got two couples now. When we come back, we're gonna find out which one of these couples is gonna go on a big date. Thank you, welcome back to The Big Date. We've got two couples that have made it. They have made it through the fire and they are together. We have Kent and Yolanda. Been back there chatting the whole time. And over here, Quante and Isha, they weren't meant to be together, but you they fought through it. Now we're gonna find out which couple is truly okay. meant to be together, because we don't want to send you out in the world and have you no, fail. No, we want you okay. to succeed. So I've got some statements here I'm gonna read to you, okay? If what I, if what I read is true about you, hold up the sign that says me, okay? You can do that right now. Show the people at home how it works. Mm. Thank you, Quante, Misha. If it's not true about you, hold up the sign that says, not me. You guys are together. Good. If you match with your partner the most, you go on to the next round and you can win the big date. Okay? That's how it works. So listen up. Let's hear what you had to say. Me or not me, I went to church last Sunday. Uh-oh. <laughs> Quante calls her a sinner holding up the not me sign. Do you go to church ever, Quante? Oh, wait a minute. Every... Yes, I go to church. Yes, I go to church. You just didn't make it last Sunday. Just last Sunday. What happened last I Sunday? I had a back problem, you know. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, because that's standing up and sitting down in church. <laughs> me or not me, I think a man should always pay for the first date. Oh! <laughs> well, you know, he, he held up the not me sign over there. Well, Big time. Okay. Yeah, did it again. Me or not me, I clip and use coupons. <laughs> Kent, you know, as I picture you on a Sunday morning with the paper there, I don't see you clipping around. Ooh, Charmin, half off. <laughs> How much money do you think you save clipping coupons? About 50 bucks a month. 50 bucks a month. Yeah! All right, guys, me or not me, I spill the details about my sex life. Not me, not me. Uh-oh. Yolanda. Kent's gonna tell. No, he won't. Yes. Oh. Yes. Wow. <laughs> me or not me, I really dig RuPaul. No! No! <laughs> We're not down with RuPaul. That's no. not happening. Me or not me, I've given money to a stripper. No! <laughs> I don't believe you. You have. Pay for it. I don't need it. Next question. No, we're staying here a second, Yolanda. Oh! Me or not me, I've posed for a nude photograph. Dying to see this one. <laughs> Quante, you posed for a nude photograph? I'll take it off in a minute. Nisha, do you own a camera? Yes, I do. You do? Hey, I do. snap, snap, girl. Let's Post go. It. Post it. <laughs> Billboard. <laughs> but you know what? You guys need to get some film because you match the most. They're our most compatible Woo! couple. Give it up for Quante and Nisha. We'll take a quick break. We'll come back in a moment to find out if they're going to go on a big date and how big that date's going to be right after this. If you or someone you know has herpes, then this is important to watch because the product I'm going to share with you is guaranteed to work. It's called Azurex. There is no cure for herpes, but there is something guaranteed to stop outbreaks, provide soothing relief, and accelerate healing. In this attack pack, there are five individual swabs. They are easy to carry and easy to use. Just snap it to activate it. If you feel an outbreak coming on, apply Azurex after that first tingle and immediately feel the relief. So if you're looking for something that's powerful, natural, and really works, then order Azurex now. Welcome back. We had a lot of people up here trying to hook up and we had some heat going on this side and this side, but it's Quante and Nisha that really did it. Give them a round of applause. Yeah. <laughs> now it's time to see how big their big date's gonna be. Now, before the show, you both told us some very personal information. I've got it right here in my hot little hands. If you can tell me true or false about your date's behavior and be right, every time you're right, we're going to give you $50, okay? You can rack up a bunch of cash. It'll be a big date. All right, all right. Now, look, we'll ask you six questions, but if you can get four out of six right, you'll be eligible to win a trip to Jamaica. We'll draw for that later on in the week. It's an all expense paid trip to Sandler's Resort. Fly right. right here on here, Jamaica. Okay, you ready? Ready. Feel like you're in the zone, Nisha? I'm ready. You want to go first? Yes. All right, here's something about Quante. True or false? Quante has had three dates in the same day. True or false? True. You say true. I Quickly, say true. she says true. Quante? False. Oh. But you thought he would have done that, huh? No, he never did it. 
All right, true or false, Quante? Nisha will only date a man if he owns a car. Quante? False. He says false. Nisha? True. Oh! oh. No money. And a question is, it begs to be asked, Quante, do you own a car? The bus. The bus. <laughs> and I'm not ashamed. Well, look, that's kind of a car. That's a car-like thing, and he owns it for a while, as long as he pays, you know, the that's token. Right. True or false, Quante likes to nibble on a woman's knees. True or false, Nisha? True. She says true, Quante? Oh, yeah. Now we're rolling. So true. Get a hundred bucks now. <laughs> true or false? Nisha has dated her sister's ex boyfriend. False. No. Nisha? Way. False. All right. Now we're rolling. <laughs> you got a hundred bucks now. Here's one about Quante. True or false? Quante has videotaped his lovemaking. True or false? <laughs> Damn. True. Nisha says true, Quante. True. Oh. Wow. Now videotape you in Jamaica, girl. <laughs> True or false, Nisha has been engaged twice. False. Nisha? True. Uh, what? You were engaged oh, twice? Guys, yeah. I'm so sorry, but you got three, right? That's $150. Come with me, guys. Oh, man. <laughs> Here's what happened. We got three out of six. Not quite enough to be eligible for the trip to Jamaica, but hey, that's $150. What are you going to do with that on your big date? We're Two bucks is bus fare. Farm. Oh, you're going to go to Knott's Berry Farm. And I'll drive, I guess. Right? And you're driving. She's driving. All right, very good. Well, I hope you had a good time. You had fun? Bring everybody else out here. All the time we have. And we'll see you next time right here on the big date. Mark Wahlberg's wardrobe is provided by Bernini.